Hey, I'm hearing scuttlebutt around the squad bay. Talk that maybe Colonel Ship took this too far. We could have quarantined Katanga, right? Called in more ships? Listen, the Colonel knows about everything people know about Xenos. How they react, how their guts work. She knew that before she joined the Corps. When she was a teenager, she survived a Xeno outbreak. Little outlier colony, you would never heard of it. One thing she'll always hold to, gotta kill them fast. The longer you wait, the more chance they got to spread. <sighs> I don't know all the details, and you know what? It ain't my place to ask, but I do know she got a twin sister, Viola. Oh, so the ship went into a goddamn hive to rescue her. That's how she learned some of the shit she know about Xenos, watching close range from inside. Maybe, but by the time a battle group got here, Wailing Yutani would have their people in system. Executives and dog catcher teams, mercenaries and lawyers. They find something to cite that the Colonel don't got authority to override, Colonial Protection Act or not. Then they swagger aboard Katanga or land on LV-895 and fuck it all up real good. Xenos find ways. They hide, go where humans can't, tight spaces, vacuum, deep cold. Wait for their chance. Come when you ain't looking and don't expect them. But just don't go bringing it up with herself. Dusabe, colonels ain't in the habit of explaining themselves to grunts. Yo, this just between you and me. <laughs>